months away, John Marston has returned to his loved ones. While trying to rebuild his ranch and win back the trust of his family, Marston awaits whatever life will throw at him. As he drives home one evening from an errand, he ponders whether a man can ever escape his past. He is a man who is ready for anything. Almost anything. Shut your ass up! If you act like a child, I'll treat you like one. What is going on? Well, well, sir, I'm a man of science, a, a man of great learning, a, a thinker, a, a wise man, and I'll be honest with you, sir, I haven't got a fucking clue. Uh, do I look like I want a kiss? Oh. Oh. You say you're sorry, you hillbilly white trash! Yeah, yeah, now how are we gonna rebuild America like this? He says he don't want them red-eyed demons. What a lovely the thing story. is, you see... Sweet Father of Mercy! Either stop dancing and start talking, or prepare to join Moses and the rest of these freaks. Are you constipated, John? Glaza! Glaza! Cowboy! Howdy! Are you blind? Move!
must be dreaming. This is some crazy nonsense. What am I doing here? Plenty of more just like him, Mr. Comedian. We got a whole host of missing folk. Stupidity got the better of me. Stupidity got the better of me. I risked my life for this? A blunderbuss? Is this a joke? What is this, 1850? Mexico.
As you imagine. Good. Did you get the dynamite? Yes. Mm. And the bait. Huh. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. How do you know? My name is Ayotioto. Ayotioto.
A horse is waiting for you. You should return home. trouble starts, I can pretty much guarantee you'll ride off into the sunset. You feeling better? Yes. I mean, once that boy stopped trying to bite me, everything felt much better. I'm starving, though. Jack? Me? Well, I only felt better once that mad look left your eye. Please, Dad, don't leave me here alone with that woman again. Uh, excuse me? I'll try not to, son. <laughs> Uh, I've heard that before. Uh. Well, let me fix us something to eat. Please don't. We've had enough dramatics for one day. 